Okay then, so I've been in the house making my plan and I'm gonna go ahead and pop this motor out and cut these old Cadillac mounts off of here and do some trimming on that piece that runs up under there. Uh, there's a lot of stuff you can buy as far as motor mounts go. A lot of different style of mounts. Uh, they've got mounts that come to the back of the motor and stick out and they got mounts that all kind of different setups for mounts that go across the front of the motor. I'm just going to make my own. Uh, I think I can and I don't think it's too uh, treacherous to do and uh, I'm just going to I'm going to get these cut off and cut down and set it back in there and kind of look at the way it sits again. And then I'll come back and uh, figure out all of that. One thing I thought I might do, I was kind of looking at the pictures of it while I was in the house. And I thought I ought to just pull a, a quick measurement. Because before I was looking at those exhaust pipes, wondering if they were going to work. And uh, I was thinking, well, the way it's sitting in there right now, it would be a good time to stick a tape measure from... This point right here is at the uh, right where the head, right where the back of the engine comes to where it would sit on the head. So coming straight out from that, looks to me like I'm looking at to the inside about 11 inches. So let's take that same measurement and go back over here and put this in the same spot right here so that would put that pipe right there at 11 inches now keep in mind it comes out at an angle kind of like this so i think i think that's either going to fit or it's going to come pretty darn close we'll find out because see from where 11 inches is is here the pipe goes kind of like that so I think that'll work. So I just ordered a thermostat and a thermostat cover and a tie down clamp from my distributor and a fuel pump. So I'm gonna pull that motor out and cut those mounts that I talked about down and then start thinking about making a new motor mount for the front of that. That's fun stuff. I like that kind of work. So let me uh, let me see. I'll set y'all over in here somewhere. I'll set you on this stool over here, maybe. That'll work. And you just watch me slide that motor right out of there. I realized too while I was under there that I've got my my uh, drive shaft wired up up under the car. So I kind of was looking at it and I was thinking, oh yeah, that's also holding that, you know, in place back there. So pull that right out. Well, it looks like this thing has got a broken bolt on the back of the transmission there. I'm gonna have to look at that. That could be a problem. Yeah, that is a problem. <laughs> Alrighty then, that's not good. Well, that's not good at all. Mercy sakes. Great balls of fire. have a look at that anyway I might wind up using that metal steel uh, flywheel